Hello guys, welcome back to my channel today. Today I wanted to do 10 products under $10 that are my favorites and these are definitely staples. You probably, I talked about them on Instagram stories, Snapchat. I've probably worn them on here a few times so let's get into it. You guys know I love Salon Perfect. They are my jam. The price is awesome and I think they give you great quality. I love this. This guy just came out. And this is their brow pen and it has the little like Kat Von D slits type of deal in the front. The reason I love this guy is because I don't have much brow and I love that it makes me look feathered in the front. And this is under $10 and it is good fine because I compared Kat Von D's to this one legit the same. No difference at all in my eyes. And I like the Kat Von D one. It's awesome, but it's super expensive. Then next up, while I'm on the Salon Perfect brand, you guys know I love their lashes. I've been wearing them since college. I talk about them all the time. I wear them all the time on my channel. I've kindly slightly been branching out, but I seem to always go back to these guys. They're so inexpensive. They're such good quality. They're a comfortable wear. They're light on your eyes. I find them very easy to put on. They don't have like a really heavy band that like weighs your eyes down where like one eye kind of up when I was kind of down like I love these lashes and if I get drunk and I ruin them I don't feel guilty about it the next day because they're under ten dollars I'm happy about it then next up I feel like I've been using this so much lately it reminds me so much of the Fenty Beauty one it's very similar and it is the NYX Wonder Stick and it's uh, contour it has the tinge side and then it has a little light side I really love it it's very creamy I actually have it on not right now, I'm just kidding. I thought I had it on, but I don't. But I do wear it all the time. I love it, especially in the summer because it's not oily, it's not heavy, um, it doesn't clog my pores, it's very easy to blend, and it's under $10. Next up, I know this has mixed reviews. I love it. I have very dry skin also. So it is a little bit creamier, but it is the CoverGirl Matte Foundation. The Shade Rage is amazing. They have a shade for everyone, I think. They are under $10, and I just think it's a really great formula. It's a great drugstore pickup. Um, I think it comes out matte. It can leave you with a soft, natural finish. You can leave you with a soft, natural finish, or you can build it up and have a really intense, full coverage finish and yeah I like it it's not streaky it doesn't come out gray on me that is what I think about it I know other people didn't like it but I feel good about it I like it then I love the CoverGirl Vital Vitalist Healthy Powder and I really 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 like this especially on my natural days it sits very subtly on your skin it looks very nice it doesn't give you a really hard coverage it's very good for like day to day it doesn't feel like you're wearing a lot of powder it doesn't I don't know clog your pores it just doesn't feel heavy and like really make your skin I don't even know how to describe what I'm trying to say, but I feel like what I'm trying to say is sometimes you put on really heavy powder and then it gets into your creases and then it kind of like makes you look like you have a lot of fine lines and then after wearing it for like, I don't know, an hour, it kind of like moves and then you can see where like the foundation moved. It doesn't do that. I feel like this sits on your skin and it just looks very natural and it can just make you look very healthy and glowy and like you're not really wearing makeup at all, but you are. So I like it. It doesn't sting. I know a lot of powders to me can smell very like perfumey. This doesn't have that smell, so I like it. And next up while I'm on my CoverGirl kick, I'm loving their new exhibition lipsticks. Here is one, I just picked one up, this is red. And I think I put this on my Instagram or like I did a picture on Instagram and it's called Hot. And it's just such a pretty red. They're so comfortable, they're so creamy. And this one is a cream one. So they come in mattes, demi mattes, metallics. They just come in all different like um, formulas of how they dry down. And I like them. I really, really, I am happy with them. The pigment's great, the pigment's on point. Um, yeah, they, they look good, I like it. Mm. And next up, I'm loving Crown. I found out about Crown through BoxyCharm. Um, and I really, really like their palette and they liked the photos I took for like wearing their palette and they were like, hey, we'll give you a code, which I know some people don't like codes because they're like, oh, you're just trying to sell this stuff. But I agree to have a code if I like a product and I really like Crown. I feel like they're super affordable. It's humongous. It does remind me a lot it does remind me a lot of Morphe. I mean, just like the looks of the packaging and stuff, but 
They go on nice. They have beautiful color uh, shade range. They have beautiful like metallic -y sparkles, and you just get so much for your products. Or you get so you get so much product for the price, and I think it's really good quality, especially if you're starting out with makeup and you're not sure which route to go, and you just want to kind of play a lamp around and like teach yourself. You're not going to be wasting fifty dollar one pan eyeshadow. Nobody wants to live that life. So I think it's cool that they are inexpensive, little inexpensive, affordable, and it's really good quality. So I do have a discount code if you want to check that out. Only because you know, like I don't want to push it on you, but like I said, if you don't want to spend a lot of money and you're starting out, you're not too sure about makeup, and you know you don't have tons of money to blow on it, I get it. So I, that's another reason I really, really like this company. Profusion. Ooh, I love. I'm always loving this. Um, I was gonna show you the other highlight one. I couldn't decide which one I. I couldn't decide which one I wanted to show you guys, but I kind of wrecked this a little bit because this was down the beach all summer with me. It's a really, really pigmented highlighter. Um, their their highlights don't play for real. Like, they're strong and they're inexpensive under ten dollars um i believe you can find them maybe in ulta maybe online on the broke floor i'm not 100 sure i feel like they sell them at target i think so but i'll check and like link it and all that good stuff but their pigments they, they don't play it's it's like really really good so oh oh my last product is the ame makeup free zone and these are just like little wipes and you can tell it's dirty because i always have them sitting right next to me because when i'm doing my makeup i always somehow mess something up so i always need a little makeup wipe but they're just like little guys and they don't burn my eyeballs which i hate makeup wipes that burn my eyeballs so i'm really happy about it they're under ten dollars i love them so i love you guys i hope you like this video and i will see you soon